Hello YouTube, it's iModify Apple here and I'm bringing you guys my top 5 iOS 8.4 jailbreak tweaks. So we're going to jump right in here and start with one of my favorite tweaks which I can currently show you, it's called Barrel. And what this does is just adds nice custom animations as you slide. I've currently have it set to radar but if we go into settings here we can see other different animations that we can give it. Whoops. A barrel. And we go into mode. And if we look here, there's other different animations we can give it. We can give it page, zoom, Pac Man. I personally kind of like the Pac Man animation if I just select that and go across. What it does is it gives you that, if you see there, that little Pac Man effect. But anyway, that's been recently updated, so now you guys can use that on iOS 8.4, so that's the first one. Second one I'm going to show you is, if you notice when I went into my settings and I was scrolling through it, you noticed how the, I have an animation in my settings, and that's to, due to a tweak called Cask. So if you go into Cask, and basically what this is, is it basically the style to your settings and other applications I think but it's mostly useful in settings and it just gives you that nice animation right there I have mine to grow so it kinda grows in when you scroll up and I, I kinda like it however there is a custom repo in order for you guys to get this so I will be putting that in the link in the, the link in the description below so be sure to check that out add it and use it Another one I like is Classic Dock. If you notice here, I have the Classic Dock and not the iOS 8, the normal dock style. Uh, I don't know, I just prefer this better to um, the newer ones because it just gives you that nice look, that glass effect and the reflection down there. And it just looks a lot better on the phone. So yeah, that's Classic Dock. That's the third tweak. And if you noticed, I have five icons down there in the classic dock, and that's due to a Cydia tweak called Better Five Dock Icon. Okay, you can't really see. Oh well, yeah, it's called Better Five Icon Dock. It will be in the link, and it will be a link in the description below to how to get that. But better because you can't really see here due to the tweet called Eclipse 2 but I'll talk about it in a second but basically but it gives you five icons down there that's basically all that tweak does and now what I was saying is Eclipse 2 that's basically given night mode in every single aspect of this including as you can see Cydia and that's also because Cydia just got an update to Cydia 1.9.19 I think where it gives the night mode theme effect to everywhere in my device hence why it's so dark and you can't really take note so that's why if you're wondering why my city looks different that's the reason why also one other thing I'd like to show you guys is lock glyph now basically it adds this PayPal touch authentication right here at the bottom what you do is when you put your finger and it scans it makes a noise and logs you in and I, I kind of like it. It just looks nice and neat on your your lock screen. Makes it look quite nice and everything. And this here now is a tweak called Transition. And what it does, as you can see there, it just gives a little animation as you swipe over there. So slide to unlock. So if I go into settings, go down to transition as you can see I have a lot of tweaks so I will be doing some more top 5 tweaks or maybe I'll just in my next one I'll do a full review of every single tweak I have downloaded but here it is transition once in there you can select what type of transition you want but I like the splash one so I'll leave it as that but yeah that's the transition tweak and wait is that 4 or 5 tweaks I don't know, I'll just show you guys two more. So here we have the tweak called Vertex, and what this does is it changes your multitasking screen, I think it's called. Yes, to looking like this. 
it's a nice little clean tweak also add your control center down there but don't worry this doesn't remove your control center sentence if we actually go into the home screen and slide up you still get your control center and my control center is only this color due to another tweak called spring to my three but I'll go through that in another video so yeah but this is and as you can see I also have a tweak called Biprotect which I'll also go over in another video which I'll be doing either tomorrow or Sunday but yeah this is the tweak vertex and there's also this other tweak called switch spring where see how I have so much tabs open easiest way to get rid of them all is with this tweak once you download it you just slide up on the first one and it says restart springboard restart quit apps or cancel so you just click quit apps do that then go back in it notice all of them are gone so that's really nice handy feature if you have loads of tabs open and you want to close them all very quickly so yeah that's it today for the top five I may have said six or may have just said five but I will be uploading more videos on the top tweaks what tweaks are like the tweaks that I use tweaks that I think are good and I'll be posting them and I'll have if there's any custom sources which I, they were for one or two of this like cast I will be putting them in the link um, the repo link in the description below for you guys to be able to get that so yeah hope you enjoy this video please like subscribe to my channel comment and share the video so more people can see and benefit from what I have to share I know a lot of youtubers out there do this but I feel like cause I currently follow some but I feel like some of the tweaks that they have uh, that they show like I have bit, like good tweaks which I don't see them showing so I just thought I'll show it off to you guys and maybe you guys can have it and you can have a good actually I want I would like to actually add one bonus tweak before I end this video it's called video pane and basically what it does is if I go into music and show you uh, let's get up on music video if we scroll down it basically asks you to detach and basically it's like a multitasking thing so we just turn down the volume so notice how I have the video there so I'll just pause this and then play that one and you can actually resize it and everything but due to because I'm using one hand I can't really do that at the moment hold on I'll try I'll try to do that there and then basically I can move it all about, just turn up the volume a bit. See, it's playing the music and everything. But yeah, due to copyright issues, I don't really think I should. I can play the music out loud. But yeah, I can have the video playing and I can, I don't know, scroll across. Um, let's say I, I can open up a game, I can be playing the game while it's there. So yeah, I can go off that. And also, one other thing I've learned is that also. If I put it there and then lock the screen and reopen the screen, it's going to still play. The only downfall though is that you can't really move it after that, it's just going to stay there. But yeah, you can have it playing in the background, like that. So yeah, that's a nice tweak. And once you're done with it, you can also like bring it big or bring it small. But once you're done with that, you can just click the X in the top corner here. And it closes away the video for you. So yeah, that's it for my top five tweaks for today so yep yeah, thanks peace